the film Milton Kurzweil, Butterflies at Sea, from 1972, precludes damaging prejudices concerning disability. <clears throat> the actor, Edward Aldrich, plays the role of Don Baker in this movie. A blind man who decides to move by his own away from his mother for two months to prove her that being blind is not an impediment to be independent. The first proof from this movie that reveals the other negative and useless comments about those individuals that have a disability such as blindness are untrue was in minute 17 with 5 seconds. In this scene, Jill Tanner was feeling self-conscious about Don being blind, so she started to ask questions, and one of them was, Don't you have trouble getting along San Francisco? And then a couple seconds after, he responded with confidence, I know exactly how many steps to the laundry, to the drugstore, and to the delicatessen. Does she even ask him where the laundry was, because she needed one. And when he told her how many steps she needed to get there, she said, I didn't see it demonstrating that her, as a normal, po normal person, could not see the laundry, but somehow Don managed to find it. Secondly, at minute 17, with 34 seconds, Gil is still really amazed by all the things Don can do, despite his disability. Does she ask him, what about your apartment? I mean, don't you buy me the things? You could get hurt. Then he persists to show her exactly what everything in his apartment was. And after he was finished showing her everything in his apartment, she felt much better and couldn't believe what Don just did and how he memorized everything around him. And said to him, I can't find anything in my place. Displaying Don, displaying that Don has all his apartment in order. To summarize, critics that are made towards disabled people in this case, blind people most of the time are inaccurate and untrue. And at the end, those who are being criticized demonstrate that they are more capable, capable than what society thinks they are.